What's going on everyone? Today is December 18th and I am going out for my last bow hunt of the year. It's so crazy that season's already getting close to wrapping up. It doesn't end until the end of the month here in Michigan, but this is just gonna be the last time I can really feasibly get out there. So conditions are great looking today. A couple days ago it was like darn near 60 degrees or even in the 60s here. And then yesterday it dropped down like 20 degrees and today it's gotten even colder. It's like about 32 degrees now as the high for the day. And over the night and into the morning, we got about two or three inches of fresh snow. So I'm very excited at having the fresh snow on the ground like that. Good cool temperatures. It, it should be decent. It's about the best conditions I could get for this time of year. Uh, you never know with the late season. It can be a little trickier sometimes, but you know, I'm hopeful, optimistic. Uh, my dad's actually going to meet me over at my cousin's and we're going to set up a pop-up line for him to go hunting and so we can both be out there together and just trying our luck see see what happens it should be a pretty good time i'm glad that my dad could go out there for this hunt it should be pretty pretty fun so that's what we got going on we got a 10 15 minute drive and i'll be at this property and get things set As the night moved on, I still hadn't seen anything when, with about 10 minutes left of legal shooting light, I got a text from my cousin saying that there was a group of deer cutting through his yard headed my direction. Immediately, 
I got myself ready and just in case that those deer had made their way towards me. Sure enough, after waiting about five minutes, I saw the first one. And then shortly after that, I saw five more with it. A group of six doe were about 40 yards in front of me, skirting around me where I have no shot. And they started to hook around me off to my right where I just do not have any good shots. So I was just in a waiting game. A couple of them were definitely nice sized deer uh, that I would happily have released an arrow on. And sure enough, when they're off to my right, a couple of them I think spotted me. And so they started to actually hook back around the kind of the way they came, but a little bit closer to me, more along the lines of where I'd have a shot. And at that point, I drew my bow back. The first three of them kind of ran through. And they weren't terribly spooked, but they were spooked enough where I was not going to be able to stop them. So they kind of cut through where I'd have shooting lanes and go to a spot where I didn't really have visibility of them. The next three that were with them though, they came through a little bit slower and I had let down at this point because I, the three were off to my right, the three had already run off to my left. And so I let down and I was just watching the three to my right to see what they were doing. And they started to follow the same path the other ones went, but they were just walking it slowly. And as they were doing that, the biggest one was actually about to step into a clearing and I was able to get drawn back and sure enough it steps into my opening and I start to settle, try settling my pin on it and I realized it was just too dark for me to take a safe shot. I just could not pinpoint where my pin would be on the deer. I could tell I had it on it but I could not safely make a good ethical shot and so I had to decide to just let that opportunity pass because it just was not enough light where I was hunting. And <laughs> It was definitely disappointing and you know I just ended up letting down and those deer eventually just worked off and kind of wrapped up my season that way. It was a cool experience, a cool opportunity and very close call but it just didn't quite come together in the time it needed to but it was a great way to cap off the season. While I'm sad to see the 2021 season go, I still enjoyed every second of it and I'm really excited to see what the 2022 season will bring.